All right, everybody. Uh, this is Amin Mojara with uh, Imagination Everywhere. And in this uh, YouTube video, the, one of the rare videos I've been, in, have been able to have time to do, um, I wanted to show you how to uh, create a dream scene. Um, dream scene was really popular in uh, Windows Vista. But a lot of you have been emailing me and asking me how do you create the same type of dream scene um, in Windows 7. And as you can see on my desktop, I have a dream scene going. The orb is, you know, doing animations. You can put videos in. Um, you can do all kinds of things. And uh, you can do the same thing in Windows 7, but I don't know why they, like, disabled it. But it is possible to enable dream scene in Windows 7 and the website that shows you how to do this uh, is called uh, uh, is called uh, mintywhite.com and uh, here's a URL right here um, if you go slash customize uh, slash enable dream scene Windows 7 it walks you through the whole thing you have to get the executable file um, let me, uh, back out of here. Uh, you have to get the executable file. And, uh, you can get the executable file if you just go on the internet and you, uh, type in, in Google, up here, like I did here, Gene Scenes, Windows 7, How To. Um, there are plenty of websites that show you that, that will get you the uh, executable file. So just download it from any of these uh, search results. Most of them have the executable file. So um, then, after you do that, install the executable file. Um, and here I'll even take you and show you uh, how to uh, install it. And if you go down here, if you see this, I have the executable file here, Windows 7 Dream Scene, or Windows 7 Dream Scene enabled. Click that. You click Run. And this pop-up window happens. And you just follow the instructions, and it will install it for you. After you've installed it, it creates a Dream Scene folder that's in this folder right here. And if we look at the path, path is uh, C Windows Web Windows Dream Scene and I have a bunch of you know things in here that I just wanted to demonstrate to you um, I have here uh, an Alicia Keys video I can set that as a desktop background and watch what happens the video starts playing in the, on the desktop background so this is just you know good examples of how you can you know have animation running in the background you know there's no sound of course but you know um, this is just something that you guys were asking me about I prefer to have my uh, my orb running in the background so that's what I have right now running in the background so you know it looks like it's underwater so uh, that's basically it. Uh, so this is just a quick tutorial on that. Thank you. Oh, oh, one last thing. Um, you definitely want to have. Um, you want to go to my computer, and you want to open up the properties part, and you want to go to um, uh, down here to performance and tools, and adjust visual effects, and make sure that you have show translucent selection rectangle enabled so make sure you have that checked else uh, Windows Dream, Dream Scene will not work and that's the last thing thank you and uh, you guys have a good day